Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, it's Eileen. And today I'm working on a few memory decks cards. I'm going with the Sunny Days collection. Um, I picked these up on scrapbook.com when they were all the rave and it was very hard to find locally. So I gave in and got it online. So one of these memory decks cards cards I'm creating for it's a deal. It is her birthday challenge giveaway. Um, all she requested was that it be pink and teal and girly and that is what I'm going to do. So I'm going to do my best to stick with those colors, but these are basically the colors that she wanted because she's going to display them in her craft room. And let's see if my glue gun is ready. Okay guys, so um, 
I just wanted to do a recap. I am using the Sunny Days, the Maggie Holmes Sunny Days collection. And this is the ephemera pack. I used a few pieces from there. <clears throat> I've also used some of her stickers from the collection. Um, this is also Sunny Days. I used the shell and the girl, which is right here and right here. Um, I used the ephemera from, I mean the um, little golf cart from the ephemera pack and the vacay, vacay vibes. So this is the third card I made. <clears throat> Excuse me. Sorry. This is the third card I made and I used the acetate ephemera. It's hard to show you but yeah it's transparent. So it's a piece of acetate and it's a little golf cart. What I used behind it were um, foam tape, the Dollar Tree foam tape, just to lift it up a little bit, but I guess it <laughs> didn't really lift it up enough. Um, I also used a pink cupcake liner from my stash, and then the leftover trim that I had made with the uh, party streamers. I sewed this. This is in a previous video. Um, so the last part I made, I turned into a shaker. <clears throat> like I said before, I saw, I was watching a Danielle from <clears throat> Pink Zebra, um, Crafty Unicorn. <laughs> so this one says Vacay Vibes, and this was inspired by Danielle from Pink Zebra, Crafty Unicorn. Um, she is the shaker queen um, in my eyes <laughs> and uh, she will turn any shape into a shaker. So the first one is my mermaid which is I love my mermaids and uh, had to find a way to put it on there. I used the gold pineapple just to give her something to um, to support her because it is it is a cutout. I just cut it straight out of the um, cardstock from the 12 by 12 scraps. Um, I added some of these blings, <clears throat> and this is a 300 pack. And I believe I got this at Walmart so many years ago. This is just leftover from the project that I used it for. I also added some pink. Uh, Rick Rack, which came from a D stash or from one of my gals who, who gave me a rack. I think it was Cat. If it wasn't Cat, it was from a D stash. <clears throat> so, yeah. And that was the trim I used. Um, I also used the Martha Stewart Bow Punch. You can see I put some bows on them well actually it was only on this one <laughs> but I used the paper from the sunny days collection this is a scrap and I just you can see put the punch right where I wanted what colors I wanted and I punched it out <clears throat> some of the ephemera here. So the sunshine is the um, acetate ephemera from Sunny Days. I um, already told you about the stickers, the clamshell and the girl. The pink um, medallion is from my stash also. I made that. And then this little list here is from the Sunny Days collection. Okay, and then when you turn it over, I left the back plain. And I wrote on the top here, open here, because I put a little, the Dollar Tree um, hook and loop dots. And I signed the inside flap so that, you know, it's me. And then I put all of my information here. And I took, I used the um, Microsoft PowerPoint to make my info and then all I had to do was cut it out and paste it 
<laughs> paste it in the into my little folio of oh, memory decks card. So that is easy as pie. I just use the hot glue to keep the hook and loop there. Okay, and I add the bling, a little bit of bling to the back. So there's only like three on this one. And the back on this one, oh, I'm sorry. So the mermaid is from a different collection. The pineapple, gold pineapple, is from a different collection. And in the background, you can see there's like a little, there's a little tag right here. It's pink and brown. <clears throat> That's from the Sunny Days collection. And so is this little banner here. This is the life. This banner here is from the Sunny Days collection also. And then I just used my bling again from the acrylic set. <clears throat> so the back is the same. I put the little Velcro dot, I signed it, I put my info in here. And that kind of cleans up my edge from the uh, trim, the trim that I made. So it covers it up, so it's pretty much concealed. So let me do this real quick because I just realized the backside of my trim is very white and now it's gonna get everywhere. <laughs> it's okay. But I love it. Okay, so I will do the same to this. And this has the same cover also for the back. <clears throat> and this one is the same thing. I put the Rick Rack to cover up my edges from the little um, tool that I use to make my shaker. So it, eh, it's not the best job, but it is covered. It cleaned it up a little bit. And so, yeah, everybody see my information, but that's okay. Um, so I didn't do anything else to the backs. I just kind of wanted to keep it plain because um, all the actions in the front. So, well, with this one, <laughs> this one, the actions in the front. But it's simple and it's cute. But I had to have one with the mermaid. I just love the mermaids. And this is little scrap from making all this. So that's it, guys. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you on the next video. Uh, welcome to my new subscribers and um, please give it a thumbs up. Really, I do appreciate your support and for sticking in there with me. Um, so I'll see you all on the next video. Thanks again. Bye.